John Vibes is here to entertain you. Musaseleko is seemingly looking for another wife using the Real Housewives of Durban reality TV show and as well he is accused of dimming Tobile's light for trying to sell his temple to the ladies. Part of the reasons that viewers were skeptical on Tabile's addition to season 2 of The Real Housewives of Durban is that we have seen so much of Seleko and his family on our TVs. More than anything, their presence has always felt like a campaign for polygamy and how glamorous and peaceful it can be, but we all know fully well that this is not their situation and their case because on several instances we have seen Musa Seleku not be in accordance with his wives. It is but true that as a couple, you all might definitely have trouble all the time, especially the polygamous homes. But this one has actually gone out of hand as Musa Seleku definitely is using the real housewives of Durban in order to look for a woman through his polygamous campaign once more. I'm about to give you very shocking and very sad revelation, so make sure you watch this video right up to the end. Before I do so, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment after watching the entire video, and hit onto the post notification bell so you will not miss out on our subsequent videos. Most viewers concerned about Thobile being a cast of season 2 of The Real Housewives of Durban is that she will get overwhelmed by her position as a third wife in her marriage and do very little to show us her character. So far, the assumptions weren't too far-fetched because whenever she appears with her husband Musa, their point of conversation is always polygamy and how good it is. Whenever the camera flashes at Seleku, he thinks that it's a good time to recruit more people into the polygamous cult already. There is nothing wrong with him justifying his desire and need for polygamy for his family, but the constant preaching and selling of the lifestyle is getting out out of scale already and many people think that he is bringing in this positivity so as to encourage women to come get married to him again. Remember that Selek was always wanted to have a fifth wife but thank God for Magwabe and Mayeni who threatened to actually leave him if he dared to. Tobile should be allowed to exist as an individual outside of the polygamy entity. We should get to experience who she is already besides being number three in a polygamous marriage. It's good for Seleko to be involved as a husband, but he should tone down on the preaching and allow his wife to shine as an individual. As it stands now, he's making sure that her, her identity is tied closely to the position she holds in his life and she's not doing much to break free from that narrative. Similar frustrations were actually shared by viewers as well. There is an overwhelming feeling around Seleka's shoving of polygamy down our throat already and a lot of people are so sick and tired of this. If Musa is definitely looking for another woman, he should definitely come clear on the reality TV show than actually turning around and encouraging polygamy of which we know fully well that polygamous marriages, most of them don't end up well or they don't do well. Look at this situation, it is very true that all his wives are still with him except for Mangwabe who is alleged to have divorced him as she was absent in the very first season of Ingumbi la Makuzikazi and everybody was shocked about this particular situation and the people came to a conclusion that she was so mad at him and decided to leave. Remember we all know that Mangwabe had told Musa Seleko countless times that she actually was going to leave him if he gets married to a fifth wife. But unfortunately, Unfortunately, he isn't married to a fifth wife, but she still left. What definitely could be the problem? Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel and hit onto my post notification bell. I love you all so dearly.